Hi, honey. I didn't think you'd be home so soon. I'm glad you got off early. That's always nice. No, I'm, I'm okay. I just, you know how work is. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I just had a rough day is all. I don't want to talk about it. It's not that important anyways. Oh, I'm not going anywhere. Just the bedroom. Because, because, listen, I have stuff to do, so I need some quiet. I'm just going to get some extra work done. It's not a big deal. Ah, seriously, I'm fine. Just let me work. Huh? I said I'm fine. Really? No, no, nothing's wrong. I, I already told you. What are you doing? Honey, I said I gotta do some work. I'm not crying. My eyes are just watering. It's fucking allergies. Leave me alone. I'm I'm all right. As I say, it's just just allergies. Go go back to whatever you were doing. No, I don't need a hug. No back rubs either. Just get away from me. Ugh. Oh. Oh my God. No. Honey, I... Fuck. What the hell just happened? Uh, honey, no, w wait, I'll, I'll stay over here. I'm not going to come any closer, I promise. Are you, is your face okay? Thank God. Listen, what happened earlier, I, there's no excuse for what I did. I shouldn't have hit you. I am so, so sorry. I know I'm not owed your forgiveness. I just, I want to explain why that happened. I, I promise I'm not trying to make excuses. And you have every right to be afraid of me. There's just, there's a reason behind it that I should have told you sooner. So at work today, my ex came into the office and Seeing her, it brought back a lot of bad memories. The, the memories, well, she, she used to hit me. Yeah, that's why I was out of sorts at work today, why I couldn't get anything done, and why I was so distraught when I came back home. And then when you came into our room like that while I was crying. I was just, I was so stressed. I couldn't handle it. And after that, when you touched me, I, I didn't see you anymore. My mind, it was like I was back with her and I got so confused and so scared that I, I ended up hurting you. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm so, so sorry. Well, I didn't tell you because I thought you wouldn't believe me. I told my friends about it while it was happening. I reached out to them and they just laughed. They thought I was overreacting, that I was being ridiculous, that I couldn't be abused. 
a man being abused by a woman. You don't hear about it, you know? So I stayed quiet. And when I got together with you, I, I wanted to be strong, to be the alpha. I wanted to be strong for you. Respect me. I thought that if you knew, you would think I was weak. Wait, what are you doing? Are you sure you want to get closer to me? No, I'm, I'm okay with it. I just, I don't want you to feel like you're in danger. No, honey, I would never, ever hit you if I was in my right mind. What happened earlier, it was just a trauma response. Oh, I feel so pathetic saying that. No offense, but I wouldn't expect a woman to understand why that's so pathetic for a guy to admit. Just understand that it's not something a guy is supposed to say. Because, because, I don't even know anymore. I'm just so upset at myself for letting her hit me for hiding this from you and for hurting you. Everything is so confusing right now. I don't know what to do. It was my fault. I should have been stronger than this. <laughs> we should just leave. I don't deserve someone like you. <laughs> Honey, are you sure that you want to stay with me? After all that I've done, God, you're too forgiving. I still can't believe that I let myself hurt you. I'm a disgrace. <laughs> yes. Want a hug, please? Let's just move slow this time. <sighs> Thank you, honey. I love you. I love you. I love you so, so much. I will never, ever hit you again. I promise. I fucking promise. <laughs> I think I'm all right now. You think it's PTSD, but what I went through wasn't that bad. Of course, hitting you was awful. That was the worst thing I could have ever done to you. I, I don't know what makes my experience different. I, I guess. Right. No excuses. <laughs> therapy but, but what if the guys find out what are they gonna think of me no i can't it's not something a man is supposed to <sighs> fine i think you're right no i know you're right Fuck what they say. I am not going to let something like this happen again. These hands will never hurt you anymore. I swear on my dignity as a man. Honey, would you be willing to go with me to my therapy session? I mean, you, you know I'm not the best with expressing my feelings and I think having you around will help push me in the right direction. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I love you so, so much. Uh, are you okay if I, if I kiss you? Mm. 
You are everything to me, honey. Thank you for understanding. Treating my feelings like they matter. I'm never, ever going to let you get hurt again. This is a promise. Yes, I swear on my life. Honey, I think we should take a little time to cool off. Can we sit on the couch together? I think we could both use some cuddles right now. Thank you. Yeah, that blanket sounds nice. What are you doing? That's probably a good idea. We should find a therapist sooner rather than later. Honey, thank you so much. I really, really do treasure you. You mean more to me than you could ever know. That's right. We're going to get through this together. We will guarantee that this never happens again. <laughs> 